Hey guys, so today we're going to be taking a look at Android 8. Uh, this is the first ever Android 8 in the game. Uh, we do have him at eight stars. I did pull him, uh, what is that, four times? Okay. Four times, yeah. That's not, that's not bad for the first time of video. So uh, this is a bit more startup than I usually do for the initial showcase, but that's just how the way the luck went. Uh, I think actually this is the first Android with Blast Armor on a strike cards. I think. I don't recall another Android character, unless I'm just misremembering, that has Blast Armor strike cards. So this is actually the first one, I think. That's, that's interesting. Um, so this guy has a few interesting things about him. He gets his Vanish back on his main ability, and um, he reduces enemies' key reduction effects for 20, uh, 20 counts. He, his ultimate does uh, nullify endurance, and then I do also want to point out the cover change ability. So it's kind of similar to Future Gohan, where it destroys two cards. Uh, he also reduces enemy vanishing gauge to zero and destroys a Dragon Ball on top of having a strike cover change. So this guy's actually, you know, he's looking like a pretty strong cover change defensive, you know, uh, um, like disrupt character. But in terms of like his actual damage and stuff, the one thing I don't really, really like design wise is the fact that he gets stronger when you have a dead ally. He gets a bunch of different, like his blue card gains a sustained damage cut penetration. He uh, gains some extra abilities, right? If there's a defeated battle member, he, he draws cards and gets extra damage. But on top of that, he is a death buff character. So I don't really understand the synergy there. Uh, it's kind of anti-synergy because usually with death buff characters, you want to sack them off to a rush first. But this guy wants you to have a dead ally. Um, it's kind of weird. I mean, I get like it sort of covers all the bases. So, like, you know, if if this guy happens to be on a team where you have somebody else just so happen to die first, then he can gain those buffs. But I, I prefer he just have other stuff there instead, but he gives a decent amount of death buffs here. 20% damage inflicted, 10% damage to Dragon Balls, movies, or androids, and then extra key recovery alongside some health restoration. So we are going to be using him on androids. Next to 17, this guy actually has a very similar ability to Roshi, where the first two times he enters the battlefield, he force draws a green card, which I think, I think that could actually be really interesting with Cell, because of course Cell has an AoE green card, so... That's this, this is like sort of the uh, the composition I wanted to test out here. Uh, we're running double blue and purple. Don't really have too many uh, frightening experiences with green units right now. I mean, there's not really many in the game, so I don't really feel like this is a bad comp for this team. We're going to be using like a half Senkai buffer with 21, the blue one, and then we're going to be throwing on the purple 21 on the bench. And then of course, we're going to go with the Android 14 EX character. Now, typically the way that it works for androids is they've always historically been a blast team. You can build cell strike base, which is what we did here. And of course I built uh, Android 8 to be strike based and I kind of went mixed with the 17. I mean, the, the, the cell equip over there is both. So, well, yeah, there we go. All right, so for Android 8, we have this equip, the Dragon Ball unique equipment, pretty good all around. Uh, then we have this, which is pretty good all around too. Bunch of strikes, double defenses, blast. And then we're going to be running this pure equip. 6% to pure strike per Android battle member, double defense. Let's go ahead and jump in. Android 8, the first ever Android in Legends. How good is he? All right, we're actually fighting somebody else using Android 8. This is the first time I've ever fought him too. This should be interesting. Funny thing is, this guy actually brought a green unit, Magenta. He's going for taps? Damn, okay, I didn't think he'd do that. Let's just go with this. I like the alternate outfit! The white, uh, okay. The white, what is that, like a white suit jacket? I don't know, white jacket. That's him with the blue card here. That's pretty good damage. Either that's good damage or bad tanking. Is he dead? I don't think we're gonna kill here, damn it. Just just short. Really? That sucks. Uh, if I go into cell, he's gonna go into his cell. What the hell? We can grab co well, it's not really gonna matter here. I was thinking we can grab Covernal here, but he doesn't draw cards on his green. Hello? I'm gonna go with this. Drawing a lot of greens here. I 
All right, goodbye to his Android 8. <laughs> okay, we actually had Covernal there, so I could have rushed, I think, after this. Alright, we got, I think this was 17 on Fusion Warriors. My, no, no, it was Namek Oak on Fusion Warriors. Namek Oak on Fusion Warriors. Re he, really? He goes to VB and then does a blast. I mean, this is where Android 8 can come in here. We destroy two cards, we remove his Vanish, and we destroy a Dragon Ball. Have fun. Well, I mean, it's VB, so you can probably still, yeah, you can probably still continue the combo, but. At least we sort of cripple it a little bit. Look at our cost. Three cost. One cost. <laughs> okay, sure, just keeps going. 17 already has his gauge built up here. And name it Goku. Here comes the green. I can destroy two more cards with the uh, Android 8 here. And destroy Dragon Ball too. Yep. Got our Vanish back here. What? What kind of rush is that? Okay, fine. We can, we can deal with this. Guess him. No. We can still deal with this. We're fine. That's a terrible rush. Alright, we're gonna explode with Cell, but the problem is we haven't gotten his gauge filled up at all, so this is not gonna do much damage. Um, alright. Let's just float up here. He's gonna sidestep, right? No, actually, he has no Vanish, right? So I can just go for this. He already used his Vanish. Wait, what? When did he... What? When did he get his Vanish back? I don't understand. He Blast Armor through my Blast, and then he Vanished, and then he Rushed. Am I... Am I wrong? <laughs> I have to go back and watch, I guess. I don't know. Nice delay there. Yeah, the card draw, or the card destruction on cover change is pretty strong. Alright, this Goku ha does have his lock in, though, so... I will... have to go to 17 here. Alright, let's just back up. Sand is terrible. I think like, I feel like we just kill someone with this. I think VB dies to this. Oh, he's definitely dead. All right, so I think VB is coming in here, which means he's gonna seal my rush. Unfortunately, we already mained with Android Eight. We have to go to Android Eight anyway here. Okay, that's good for us. Let's go blue. I feel like Android 8 actually had a lot of value in this match with the card destruction on cover change. Alright, so he's out of the way. I'm just gonna press whatever card we draw first, which I don't know if we will draw one, yeah we don't. He should just ult here, I guess, to kill. Blue, it's not gonna kill. With 17 on the team, I don't think so. Why would you waste the Banish Restoration like that? Are you stupid? Okay. You could have easily won that. I'm actually pretty scared of uh, Kid Goku. Okay, well, that's good. Oh, a, dr a green. I'm actually going to drop here. Nice. I think he's switching, so... I'm going to drop. He's switching, yeah. I'll just keep dropping. Okay. 
No reason to go into Android 8. Android 8 is definitely going to be more of a defensive option. Uh, this, he is not a character you want to like switch into mid combo. It's not his design. Okay, well, that sucks. All right, so now we go into Android 8. Kill two cards, kill Dragon Ball, kill his Vanish. Ow, <laughs> that's a lot of damage. Yeah, and the combo's done. He sidestepped. Fortunately, we can't rush. We have Covernal, though. Does he know? All right, and don't forget, this guy's uh, ultimate nullifies Endurance. So we can kill someone here, guaranteed. Nice. All right, this is a little weird. Android 8 killing Kid Goku. I don't remember this happening in the movie. To kill him? I think he's dead. Okay. Okay. Um, do I really care? I mean, we could just sack Cell here. How much? How much longer until Seventeen gets his gauge? I don't think we've been hit that many times. Remember, uh, Android Eight also gives death buffs. Maybe we just give him up. Let's, okay, so Android 8 killed both of his characters. I'm actually gonna, at this point, I'm gonna give him up. All right, 17's gauge proc means he can't ult. Go ahead and kill him. I want the death buffs. Remember, 30% damage to Android. He has no rush because we destroyed a Dragon Ball just now. Means we can do this, and that is game. I mean, Android 8's really damn well in that one, okay. All right, cool. This guy's running the uh, Ginyu Force team. Love to see that. It is definitely not uh, someone living geographically close to me. You can tell instantly. Okay. Is he got a blue card? What is he, what is he doing here? You have a blast? Interesting. Well, let's get our gauge here. Not going to do much damage, but we can try and rack up a rush pretty quickly. Which is the best way to deal with uh, the Ginyu Force team. Okay, if we can ever grab Dragon Balls, that would be nice. Hello, Dragon Balls? Hello, Dragon Balls? Of course, the only one we get is on the blue. I don't think we're going to draw that green card, yeah. Goes to, what? Why would he go to G's for that? Oh my god, it's a lot of damage. Why would he, what? Why would he do that? Uh, sure, we'll leave him in. Let's try and go for a Vanish into the green card, see if he goes for anything. Nothing. Right here. Nothing. I'm gonna main. I'm gonna tap here. Rush. Perfect. Alright, kill him. Probably not gonna kill. I have minus 80% arts power. I don't think we're gonna kill. I don't think we're gonna kill uh, <laughs> Raccoon with this. Well, are we? Hmm. We have the 17 Rising Rush damage buff here. I, this is gonna be tough. I mean, he's. This is the tankiest yellow in the game by far. I think we're gonna kill anyway. Damn. Okay. All right. Well. All right. We'll get our gauge filled up here. You should probably just go to Ginyu. He has double card draw with Ginyu now. Well, in five counts. Let's get this gauge, and then I'm going to go back into Android 8 to destroy two cards. Destroy a Dragon Ball as well. It's pretty good. Alrighty. Let's just 
get as much damage in here as we can. There's no way he switches to Birder, I don't think. He's got to let him revive here. Yeah. Okay. Question is, do we pop the main? I don't think we need to right now. We have full HP. Yeah, we're fine. Alright, scary looking team. You brought Zamasu? Okay. I'm gonna go into Cell. We can actually do this. Well, god damn it. We have no cards now. That sucks. Yeah, I don't know how much I like that green. Just because it doesn't draw a card. It gives you double card draw speed, but a lot of times, like, you can't chain it into other stuff that you want to do. Uh, you... Are you okay? What are you doing? Hello? I mean, I, I'm interested in hearing what you guys have to think about uh, Android 8 here. I think he's he's done pretty well. I don't really have any... Oh, that's, that's annoying. Uh, okay, whatever. <laughs> we're, we're not off to an exceptional start in this one. I... Okay, he has no Vanish. We can do this. I don't really have any major complaints about uh, our friend Android 8 so far. I feel like he's done pretty well. I'm going to drop here. I feel like he has done very well. Let's drop again. Okay. I could play. All right, I think we'll do another one after this because this wasn't really a match. But yeah, I mean, he's honestly, he's looked pretty decent offensively. I don't want to call him like overwhelmingly good offensively because that just wouldn't be correct. But, you know, he can get his vanish back from his main ability. He has a lot of disrupt. He's pretty tanky. I, I don't really have much, much to say here. He's just a really good character. I think we'll make this the final match. We have a green, huh? Should have just went with the strike. Uh oh. Well, I mean, this doesn't really matter because we can drop here, though. I was going to say I can chain it into uh, Android 8, but of course we cannot, unfortunately. Is this going to be a cell fight here? Looks like it, because now we just do this. Faint. Almost. We almost got it. Don't worry, I, know, I can tell we almost got it. You like green cards? So I heard you like green cards. All right, goodbye to your hand. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, really? <laughs> yeah, he has no cards. What if I just press this? Damn. Interesting.
I mean, this is canon, right? Android 8 beating the hell out of uh, Ultra Instinct Goku. You guys remember this? Wait, he, he lived? No. I should just rush, but whatever. Okay, now we can make use of the green card. Carbon all plus double card draw speed here, right? A blue. Damn, we didn't try anything else. Wow, we haven't gotten our gauge built up at all. <laughs> Zero percent. Okay, now it's halfway. And right, now it's at two thirds. Alright, now it's a four fifths. Alright, now it's a five sixths. And now it's filled up. Now, let's see how much damage he does here. We killed another Dragon Ball. He has no vanish now, so he's gonna switch in the UI, so I'm gonna go for a tap attack here. That's zero damage. Rush, go for it. Rush, go for it. Rush, go for it. He has no vanish, right? We already killed his endurance, I think, didn't we? Pretty sure we already killed his endurance with Cell earlier. But yeah, I would like to hear what you guys think of Android 8 down below. I'm actually genuinely curious because this is an interesting character. He's actually not bad at both offense and defense, which is not something we typically see too often these days. So. Pleasantly surprised here. Let me know what you, what you guys think down below. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you all in the next one.